Shalom. I want to give all praises, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rechakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings and salutations to the sincere Akim across the globe that's pushing his word in all truth and sincerity. Okay, it's the brother Yah Rock from JMS Houston back once again. And uh, Lord willing, this will be a quick, edifying lesson. But um, I uh, just had two points. Uh, that I wanted to make in Revelation 22, in a first um, verse that I want to uh, touch on is verse 7, and these are the words of our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, okay, so real quick, this is Revelation 22 and 7, behold, I come quickly, blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of this prophecy of this book, okay, so once again, it says, Behold, I come quickly, and this is our Lord Yahweh Shah. Okay, blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. Okay, now that's the first point I wanted to touch on. Um, as the Lord said, man, blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. All right, um, you know, other scriptures. Um, well, the Lord said, blessed is he that uh, is found watching, okay? You know, the point being, staying active, you know, um, staying uh, on, your, on your watch, on your guard, you know, um, concerning this truth, concerning the faith, okay? Um, being diligent, you know, all of that goes into that, man, you know? The Lord is not a... You know, looking well, when the Lord returns, I should say, put it in, the, in, in this aspect, uh, when the Lord Yahweh Shah returns, you know, he's not going to be uh, pleased with, with, with those individuals who, who have been part of the faith at one point, but took their hand off the plow, okay, um, stop watching, stop reading, okay, um, you know what I'm saying? He's not going to be pleased with those individuals, okay? Uh, as a, another scripture that comes to mind, uh, by the Lord himself, uh, Yahweh Shah, who says that uh, many shall say in that day, Lord, Lord, have I not prophesied in thy name, but I have not known them, okay? So there's going to be many that who uh, took their hand off the plow, basically, okay? Uh, for however long, you know, they've been uh, on the highways and byways, uh, preaching the gospel, okay? Been a believer of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, but for whatever reason, uh, drew back into the world, took their hand off the plow, stopped teaching, stopped going out on the highways and byways, okay? Uh, lost faith. You know, maybe even never had faith to begin with. You know, uh, the point being that I want to make is, you know, in that day, as the scripture said, I come quickly. All right. The Lord, Yahweh shot in that day. There won't be a time of, OK, let me go ahead and throw my garment on. And, you know, Lord, Lord, I prophesied in thy name. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That, you know, you can throw that out the window, man. Okay? The Lord is not going to be pleased with that. All right? Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's an old saying in the world, man, you know. But uh, it's uh, if you stay ready, you won't have to get ready. Okay? So, right. I'm going to read the scripture again or the verse, uh, Revelation 22 and 7. Behold, I come quickly. Blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. Okay. So, right. There won't be no last minute uh, getting into this thing, man. You know, uh, there won't be no last minute trying to, uh, you know, make yourself look good in the eyes of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah in the day of judgment. Okay. You know, because ultimately, you know, 
the Lord sees everything, man. You know what I'm saying? The angels are keeping watch of everything that we do. You know, um, so the Lord knows uh, who are those faithful and unfaithful servants are. Okay. So you can't pull one over on Yahweh Bashim Yahweh So my next point um, is the verse, uh, the 12th verse. Once again, is Yahweh Shah, okay? Revelation 22 and 12. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be, okay? So, right. Once again, it says, and behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me, all right? So, um, let me just look up this word reward. Uh, this, and this is out the blue letter, okay? Uh, the word reward. Strong G, 3408, Miss Thos. Miss Thos. All right, it says dues paid for work, wages, higher uh, reward, use of the fruit naturally resulting from toils and endeavors. All right, here we go. In both senses, rewards and punishments. Okay. So, right, and it's the point. Uh, rewards and punishments okay so you can be rewarded uh for doing a righteous uh deed in the eyes of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shah okay I'm gonna go back to the uh to the verse okay so Revelation 22 and 12 and behold I come quickly and my reward is with me right so they reward you know, is that that judgment that's going to be issued? You know, it can be a, a a reward of being amongst the elect. Okay, those that have been diligent, those that uh stayed on their watch. Okay, those that are found to be those faithful and loyal servants. Okay, and it also can be. Um, reward all right uh, uh could be a day of a uh, uh, death and destruction man okay for those that have been found to be unfaithful servants okay those that took their hands off the plow all right those that drew back into the world delayed the lord's coming okay you see so once again revelation 22 and 12 and behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me, to give every man according as his work shall be. Okay? So, you are going to be judged according to your actions. Okay? Everything that you do is going to be held in account. All right? And a lot of our people, uh, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, okay, a lot of our people believe that the laws are done away with or... You know, we don't have to uh, uh, obey the, the commandments from Yahweh, Yahweh power, all right, that we can continue to do whatever we want to do, you know, as far as breaking the dietary laws, you know, as far as committing adultery, okay, as far as serving other idols, being into different uh religions and doctrines, you know, whatever it is, uh, whatever it is, you know, but no, okay, the Lord, Yahweh Shah himself says that uh, his reward is with him uh, to give every man according as his work shall be, okay, so whatever you do, you know, you're going to be held accountable for it, man, you know, you're going to be judged according, uh, accordingly, man. Okay? Um, you know, I was watching one of the brother's videos earlier, and he made uh, he brought out the scripture, uh, Ecclesiastes 8 and 11. 
Okay, because since it's against an evil work, it's not ex executed speedily. All right. It's in us uh, sons of men to do uh, wickedness. Okay. So, right, just because you've been living a life of uh, wickedness, man, you know, for however long and nothing happened to you, don't think for one second that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is going to let you, let you off the hook. Okay. Um, you know, so once again, in closing, this is uh, Revelation 22 and 12. And behold, I come quickly and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be. Okay. So, right. Um, and that's pretty much, uh, pretty much it, you know. So, once again, I want to give all praises, glory, and honor. Unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rahakwadash. The bonus to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings and salutations to the sincere Akim pushing this word in all truth and sincerity. Shalom.